Hey everyone, it's Jeff from Herman House Attic here. Got a little piece of history, children's history. Um, I found this in a very interesting place. <laughs> I was actually tearing down one of the chimneys in the house. And I took it down below the roof. And when I got down below the roof, there was um, some books scattered around the base of the chimney in the attic, the rafters. And uh, there this was laying, just, it was behind one of the bookshelves full of books and I mean, you wouldn't have seen it from the, from inside the attic itself. I had just found it through um, tearing that chimney down. And uh, obviously being Disney, it looked old. So I snatched it up, put it in a safe place, and so here I am gonna do a little video on it. Um, so as you can see, it's Walt Disney's Snow White and the Sifts. It's a 96 page book. Um, so Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, the film was actually released to the public February 4th, 1938. And so uh, it was, I imagine it was a big deal. And so here's this storybook, which is based on the, the movie, of course, or the story. And this was, uh, this belonged to the Herman's daughter. And so she did color, or somebody, I imagine it was her. She, somebody colored the, a few things here and there. Um, the, does have a, a rip right here and. The cover is pulling off the staples, but it's still all bound. Of course, the Seven Dwarfs, Walt Disney's Snow White and Seven Dwarfs, a story based on the famous movie. So, it looks like it's a. It's called the story. It refers to itself as a storybook, but um, it's almost like it's a coloring book storybook. And so, but this particular one. It's copyrighted 1938. So Walt Disney Enterprises, Hollywood, California, all rights reserved, printed in the USA. So that's that's really cool. So, you know, Snow White, so this is this book is from the same year that Snow White the movie was was released. And that's just I don't know, that's, that's, that's really, really neat. And so, uh, I feel like this is, you know, pretty, pretty cool piece, pretty important piece. But, um, anyway, so it goes through the story, and a few of them are colored, but uh, the rest of them are not. I think this is the last one that's colored, the, the witch, or the, uh, what is she? The queen. And so, uh, it's complete. I haven't read through the, through the story but I don't think this as I flip through these pages they feel kind of delicate so I'm not sure this is something you would give your child or even read from to your child unless you're reading very delicately but anyway so it goes through there's no table of contents I'm not sure how many chapters or pages it's supposed to have but in the forest chapter four Chapter 5, Snow White Seeks a Haven. It's really hard to flip because these pages are so delicate. Chapter 6, The House of the Seven Dwarfs. And the dwarfs all have their names, of course. There was, a, I guess, a, a time when they didn't have names, but I think that predates Di uh, Walt Disney's version. I think his always had the names, I believe. Um, chapter 7, The Rival of the Seven Dwarfs.
eight, the dwarfs meet Snow White. Here's the six. Where's the seventh? I'm not sure why there's only six. Where is Grumpy. I don't see Grumpy. Chapter nine. The princess and the dwarfs become friends. Chapter 10, food and gaiety. Eleven, the wicked queen and her magic. Twelve, the witch and her magic. Uh, Thirteen, a happy ending. Fourteen, please make Grumpy love me. <laughs> ah. I'm trying to figure out how to turn these pages without I'm doing that. Poison apple. Dwarfs worn snow white. A gift for Snow White. Snow White has a guest. There's the Wicked Witch. Dream, dreams come true. There's the prince, and they live happily ever after. So that's the whole story. There's the back cover. This is W714. I'm sure that means something, but I don't know. So anyways, some um, coloring storybook of Snow White pretty early on. Actually, the from the, that year that Snow White was... This is copyrighted the year that Snow White was actually released to the public. It was released in Hollywood in December of 37, but um, early February 4th of 38, it was released to the public. And uh, so anyway, it's a really cool, cool book and uh, hope you enjoyed and thank you. Thank you for watching.